You know, it seems like such a harmless act, you know, that we can, we're in control. We don't, we don't think about what the consequences could be of something like this. They need to realize that texting can cause injuries and even death. With today's technology, texting while driving is a serious problem among all ages, and it's going to take the entire community to stop it. My dad takes my phone whenever I'm driving. I've been guilty of it myself, and I um, really had to step back and take a second thought about it because of my own children. During KHQA's visit to Kia Kakai, we reminded these students to think twice before taking their eyes off the road. But at first, many seemed resistant to the idea that texting could cause accidents. Two students who told us they're masters at texting were asked to walk and text at the same time while blindfolded. They discovered it's not so easy. Being blindfolded and taking your eye off the road, it's not so much about you yourself, but it's the other person who you have to worry about coming down the road. So it's a, uh, it was a great where they were walking and they hit the, the pylon and they kind of swerved one way or the other. And they pull the car one way and can run into somebody else. And that's the seriousness of this situation. It wasn't worth the text message to hurt somebody else. At this age, they're dreaming. They're thinking what they want to be when they grow up. Those dreams can go up and smoke in a hurry with just a minor lapse in judgment in one instant. Until it actually happens to them, they don't realize it, but it, making them aware of the situation that it can occur, and it may not be them, it may be somebody else. Think about those things, the consequences, the long-range ramifications of it before they uh, pick up that phone. Just let it ring. Brooke Hash, KHQA News, Keokuk, Iowa.